Alright guys, we are uh, stress testing with uh, Prime 95 right now, the E8400, uh, 1.224 volts under load. Uh, we're currently running at uh, 415 by 9, which gives us uh, 3.737 gigahertz or 3737 megahertz, either way you want to say it. Uh, let's look at... Uh, temperature there, core temp, uh, move over here, you can see we've been going for about almost four hours, give or take, we get our specs down here for the processor and uh, if you want to know what uh, what batch or anything like that to have a comparison it's a uh, it's a later one I have another video that says all the specs but uh, it's a Q815 I believe is the first four digits it is a 52008 pack date so it's a lot later than some of the ones that I've seen who have hit uh, 4 to 4.3 on air easy um, <clears throat> had to ramp voltage up quite a bit going from 3.6 to 3.7 but like I said if you look at it now it's really nothing to worry about uh, I'm running the RAM at 1 to 1 uh, let's see if you can link the RAM here 430 megahertz crucial ballistics so it's that if you guys look over here it's our temperatures speed fan been adjusted. They're actually one degree higher than core temp because I set them like that. So there you guys go. There's that. Temperatures for everything. It's under 100% load. So um, all right, you guys, make another video here uh, whenever I get 3.8 stable. So I'm gonna run this about uh, probably four or five more hours and then I'll uh, call it quits. Go to 3.8. Nine hour, eight to nine hours, good enough for me. So, all right. Thanks for watching.